Hey guys, I want to give you some information about the 20 long and just ignore that the pop box back there. That's that's garbage. It's just my that won't fit down there, so just ignore it. There. Alright, so the 20 gallon 20 long. You see him over there? My niece wants to name him water. Not kidding. Water. Water that you drink. She wants to name that fish water. But right now he is more of an albino-ish color looking uh, goldfish. So I just thought, you know what? I'm gonna, Since nobody has given me any name suggestions for the goldfish, I'm just going to call him Casper. Isn't Casper the, the friendly ghost? You know? So when he gets bigger... If he if he lives that long to where he'll get you know about six or seven inches long by maybe like an inch or two tall something like that where he becomes to the point where he's outgrowing that tank then I'm gonna move him into this now with this tank this will be his new permanent home because I can't well first off I can't afford a huge tank and secondly because I'm on the second story of the apartments here um, going out and getting a 75 gallon aquarium even even a 55 gallon aquarium they won't allow it if I went out defiantly and bought it and set it up they would kick me out of the apartment they would evict me so rather than having that on my uh, I guess you call it credit history just decided you know what? I'm just gonna stick with just a 20 gallon long for now until I move to a, a different apartment and they allow me to have a 55 gallon. And I'm looking guys, I'm definitely looking for no, another apartment. So the reason why I haven't filled this up completely, there's a few reasons why. When I bought this at the dollar per gallon sale over at Pet Supplies Plus here in my hometown, I didn't do, I did not fill this thing up completely full of water. I put sand in it. Mm -mm, I didn't like the sand, so I chose to put the gravel in. And there is 15 pounds of gravel. And here, there's only that five pounds of gravel. And the reason why I'm a little iffy, a little worried, is because, see this gap right here? That's what concerns me. The only thing holding it up is that strip of wood. So yesterday I filled this aquarium up three inches full of water, which would be about about right here. About, yeah, about about right here. So, and I wanted to do basically a water test just to see if anything would happen. Knock on wood. Come to find out that my cat got inside of my fish tank here. Because there's no hood. He just jumped in, got his paws wet, jumped out, and said, nope, not having any part of it. So, another reason why is I wanted to get the water in here. I wanted the pressure of the water to gradually get, you know, the, the water pressure to ex try to expand. I wanted to do it ever so gradually. I don't want to just dump a whole butt buttload of water in here and have the whole thing just go so yes I filled up with three inches I filled another three inches so that's a, just about almost half full and I want to see if by me slowly filling this up I'm checking all along here to see if the silicone here is cracking if the silicone is cracking and separating from the wall, then I gotta drain a little water out. When I get paid, I'm gonna get me two five foot pieces of PVC pipe. And I got a PVC pipe cutter here, and I'm just gonna go put the put a piece right here to support this and one on the far corner. But I don't see any issues so far with it being filled halfway. 
uh, we're darn near close to being halfway because this is 12 inches tall. And I got dried about six inches, so it's about a hundred pounds worth of water in there right now, and nothing has happened yet. The tank is somewhat supported on this side, but that's about uh, well, that's about like maybe 12 inches right here, maybe 12 inches long. At any rate, I'm just gonna slowly fill it up with water. I'm gonna check on this side and see what happens. And then, once I'm confident and knowing that the uh, there's going to be no issue with this or with this, then I'll drain all the water out. And then when I get my hood and my water filter and my heater and my decorations and everything, then I'll slowly fill the thing back up again and double check.